Yeah, let's talk about that, because I don't think a lot of people know how bad a shape that the modern church is in. Even pre-COVID, it was shrinking rapidly. It's losing relevance. Religious segment is the people that check off none when they say, which religion are you affiliated? Those are the largest growing segment of the population right now. People just don't find a need for it, which is crazy because if you look at the world, there's still just as many problems, if not more. You got like loneliness epidemics spreading around the world. You got opioids. You got all kinds of stuff. Suicide is up. Alcoholism. All these different things are up, but people aren't finding, they're not thinking that church is the answer. You know, unfortunately, we as Christians have done just a poor job of letting people know that we do have the answer for everything you just mentioned there. And either that or... We know we have the answer, but the way we're trying to deliver it just isn't effective. Hey, come to church just doesn't work right? as much as we wanted to. I mean, I was so resistant. The church to me was like the enemy. We're going to get into the go method. I want to really want to get into the specifics about how we're doing it, what we've discovered so far, what God has shown us. There's a lot of people in the church world, I've been around it for a minute, that think they're doing it right, but yet they don't ever have guests. You know, so that's where I want to check people and go, look, before you think you got it all figured out and you look down your nose at somebody that might be doing it differently. How many first time guests have you had to church in the last year, six months, yeah. two years, longer? You know, yeah. if you're just there taking up space and you're sitting in your holy huddle, speaking Christianese, you're doing it wrong. Or if you are inviting and they're not coming, maybe right. there's a more effective way of getting them to come because- the goal isn't how many did you invite, it's how many lives have <laughs> changed and impacted because of your intentionality for, um, for sharing the hope that you have. Love it. Wise as serpents. The Bible says wise as serpents. So there's a better way of doing this, guys. It's called the go method.